tapar, tapar bien los huecos por donde pueda entrar el barro y el agua y, y nada, y esperar que no pase nada raro. Well, today, obviously, I'm hoping for, for a really good ride. It's really cold now, but um, I'm going to go to the training area and warm up and uh, and hopefully be on top form today. The weather, I don't know, at the moment it's quite nice, but uh, early in the week it rained every day and the ground is really wet, so keep the fingers crossed and hopefully the, the sun will shine on me today. He's coming back to um, section eight. He's coming back to uh, Section is very difficult and uh, may maybe many points, but I, I like this section. It's a round of applause as well. Are you up to, to have the British crowd behind you? Um, getting a little bit stale the last few years, been difficult to motivate myself, and I think you've been in Ireland, it, uh, it eases him a lot. <laughs> Creo que sí, que será más difícil que la semana pasada en Bélgica, ¿no? Espero que las zonas pues, sean lo compli complicadas que las vimos ayer y que sea positivo para mí y pueda estar lo más adelante posible. Mark, good morning to you. Yeah, of course, last year the British World Round was in the Isle of Man, so it was difficult for a lot of people to arrive, but... Uh, Two years ago in Oxton Park, we have a good public, especially on the Sunday. So I'm hoping, uh, hoping for a good result and keep the crowd happy again. I'm, I'm happy to be here again at Hoxton. The sections look good, and I hope for a good result today. <coughs> We're going to close down now, and uh, we'll see you out up on the end there. Hills in Hawkesbury. Which I will see you later. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank Bien, está bien, perfecto. Ya se ve uno.
Martin, bike at the end of the section. See that? Not, not so well. We just had a big crash in the last section. No, but it, it, you must admit it's a lot better than the trials that we've had already this year. Basically, there's time for the riders to make a mistake or get some points back. Bueno, no, yo creo que Dui se va a rehacer de del cinco que ha hecho antes porque el ideal pues lo permite selectivo, pero bueno, da morada a los otros también. get to the finish um, and, uh... uh, and gas gas cloudy and Paul my mechanic have helped me a lot today and the last lap has been crazy completely crazy just full gas everywhere but uh, I'm happy I've enjoyed the sections it is nice to ride in front of the home people for the cheering and the, the air horns and I'm pretty happy today Bueno, la verdad es que este año he aguantado casi todas las carreras, ¿no? Pero a mí me van mejor los triales difíciles, pero este no era muy difícil tampoco, pero más que los, que los anteriores. Y he empezado muy mal y al final he ido arreglando. Lástima de un 5 en la última zona. Le hubiera hecho una vuelta muy buena, pero en fin, es así.
Yeah, but not riding well today. I have a big crash on the section uh, four on the Good first lap where I break the handlebar. But, uh, Tim to come up to the it's been a Tim very difficult Fairbrother. day today. I haven't ridden very well and I don't know, quite nervous. Just Yeah, concentrated. I rode well directly after the crash, but I made too many mistakes uh, in crazy sections, really. So uh, it was uh, disappointing. Here's your first, second, and third. Hopefully they're going to come back tomorrow and they're going to come back tomorrow and, re and repeat it. Perhaps the position's right from the start, <laughs> and they certainly will work very hard to pull it, pull it back. Pues me encuentro como siempre muy animado, con ganas, hace un día muy bueno y espero que me salga un poco mejor que ayer. Ayer me, se me fue un poco la carrera en la primera vuelta, en la segunda vuelta remonté pero no fue suficiente y yo espero no fallar ya desde un principio. <risa> Bueno, sí, intentar pues eh, seguir en la misma línea de ayer, que al final pues no conseguí la victoria por muy poco, después de bueno, un poco de lío en el tema de, de los puntos de Dubi que no coincidían con los que me habían dicho, pero bueno, espero hoy pues seguir eso en la misma línea y poner las cosas difíciles, que creo que conseguirlo aquí en Inglaterra es muy difícil. Yeah, yesterday was very close. Mark was riding very well and didn't make many mistakes. I made a couple of mistakes early on in the trial and I found it difficult to fight back after then. Um, I don't think they've changed any sections, so I, I was hoping that there would be one or two harder sections, but it doesn't look like they've changed anything. So uh, I'll just have to fight harder and clean as many sections as possible. <laughs> And the pass? Do you have the Ah, okay, very good. Bueno, en principio comenzamos un poco flojos, pero a medida que está pasando el año, pues me voy encontrando mejor. La pierna va casi al 100% y las carreras van saliendo un poco mejor. But I think deep car, no? Because very slippery. They're all up on the other side of playing the band. Next one. I can't speak to them. As we get to our second place man yesterday, Mark. Do you need a pair of scissors or a knife? He's done it. Yeah, luckily they were a fizzy out just about 20 yards away and he kind of... A lot happy and he, he really, in true Dougie style, pulled all the grit out and went... And...
Bueno, hoy un poquito mejor hasta ahora. Creo que hemos cogido un poquito más el ritmo de carrera y bueno, hasta el momento solo hemos cometido un error y bueno, vamos a intentar si podemos seguir haciendo las zonas bien. Lo que ocurre hoy es que han cambiado un poquito, no en cuanto a trazado, sino en cuanto a estado. Están con muchísimas más regateras, salen muchas más raíces y lo que hay que intentar es seguir muy bien la trazada pues para evitar poner pies. Típico, cuando las cosas a veces van bien, luego se tuercen y llevamos dos cinco y vamos bastante mal. De momento. Intentaremos recuperar, pero es bastante difícil durante la tierra. Muy bien hoy, riding a lot better, más confident. The weather's a bit warmer and the bike's running nice now. Se busca en la prueba en Quito, eh, que él no hay nada. Obviously up there with the old ice packs and trying to... Okay. 